Greetings. My name is Jeremiah Fick, and I want to share with you my personal creed. What is the most admirable creature on God's green earth? Why, it's the bee. Have you ever seen a bee on vacation? Have you ever seen a bee take a sick day? Well, my friends, the answer is no. So I say, be the bee. Be the bee. Mr. DeWitt? Uh, yes. Hold for Mr. Fink, please. What's going on? DeWitt, Fink here. Listen, my boy, we've had our eye on you, and I can tell you right now that you are our top candidate. Top! <laughs> now, uh, my associate, Mr. Flambeau, will help you with anything you need. <laughs> what the hell was that? I have no idea. He seems oddly pleased to make your acquaintance. The man's got an ego. Find a variety of supplies here that should see you through your visit. Found some money. Catch, Booker. What does Mr. That'll Fink do. want with us? Excuse me, miss, but Mr. Fink's interest is strictly in the gentleman. But why? So sorry, young miss. But any questions regarding the gentleman's application should be taken up with Mr. Fink directly. Does this strike you as good news? Doesn't strike me as good news. What do you think? Head to the gunsmith or scavenge supplies by that clock shop? 20 minutes. 15 minutes. 15 minutes now, bid 14. Will you give me 14? 10. 10 minutes, bid not 10. Will you give me 9? 9. I bid 9. 9 minutes, bid. 9 minutes, bid. 9 minutes, bid. 8 minutes, bid. 8 minutes, bid. 7 and a half. 7 and a half. 6 minutes and 15 seconds. 6 minutes and 5. 5 minutes, 50. I can do 5 and 50. Here it is, Booker. Chen Lin, gunsmith. I have a pressing need to speak to this so-called false shepherd, stirring up so much trouble. We got enough problems without this damn fool shooting up the city and blaming it all on the Vox. Though if he's amiable, yeah. Yeah, he might be just the fellow we need for our immediate concerns.
Gautama Buddha. Who? The founder of Buddhism. Spent 49 days under a Bodhi tree until he achieved enlightenment. Someone tells me Comstock doesn't cater to idols getting worshipped at him. Hello? Hello? Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Is anybody here? What happened here? Someone worked this place over. Local constabulary, no doubt. Did you hear that? There's someone downstairs. Excuse me. Now I'm sorry to bother you. I... We're looking for Mr. Lin. Mr. Chen Lin. Booker. Mr. Lin, not here. He gone. Gone? They take flying squad. I pray, Gautama Buddha. Pray, give husband back. Give back to Melin. Where did they take him? Club. Everyone take to good time club. Where is this club? <laughs> Ma'am, please, where, where is this club? Hooker, we'll find it. Just leave her be. Why not Vox Bully help Chen Lin? Why not Daisy Fitzroy help Chen Lin? <laughs> Who are the flying squad? Cops. The kind who probably got their boot on Lin's throat asking him how well he knows Daisy Fitzroy. Isn't she the one we're working for? As a matter of fact, it is. Right, let's figure out where this good time club is. Song before. I don't suspect anyone's friends. I'm sorry about what I said at the docks. Side and find Mr. Lin. Just call me Booker. Welcome to the Good Time Club! 
Find Shen Lin and get the hell out of here. Now, now, all I ask is that you finish what you started to it. Wouldn't want to disappoint the other applicants. Do it. Sure, sir. Our first candidate is a veteran of Peking. Now, what's that they say about old soldiers? <laughs> Frankly, my money's on you. He's something of an old hand at handling explosives. Only man I know who hasn't <laughs> lost a limb working with them <laughs> yet. Oh! <laughs> 
an expert with the automata wants to replace all our security with machines. I'll give the old boy credit though. It would be fewer mouths to be. That I was quite wrong. I'm not interested in your job, Fink. Now, now, I know all about your little job for Fitzroy. But do you really want to take her offer over mine? Do you know how many people would kill to be head of Fink Security? <laughs> You're a tough nut to crack, Mr. DeWitt. A tough nut, <laughs> but... Uh, you this. I will get what I want. like Fink. Really? And I was with the Pinkertons. They call us in when the workers got restless. To do what? Demonstrate the folly of men striking, throwing down tools. You hurt people. I'll tell you this. Sometimes there's precious need for folks like Fitzroy. Why? Because of folks like me. All done. Code 
Lock. Any idea what it deciphers? No. Let's keep an eye out. Tell us what you know about Fitzroy, you goddamn gook. We know you can hear us. You want to say something? Or you want us to bring in Mrs. Lynn for company? Uh, throw a bucket of ice water on him. We got three more to bring in tonight. Oh, what's that smell? Ain't no pretties down here. I treat them like animals. Is that not cruel? To forbid the mixing of the races. Is that not cruel? Give the vote to the white man and deny it to the yellow, the black, the red. Is that not cruel? But is it not cruel to banish your children from a perfect garden? Or drown your flock under an ocean of water? Cruelty can be instructive. What could people have done to deserve to be locked up in a place like this? Fink don't need much of a reason. No. No, he doesn't. Crack this one open? Let me have a look. All yours. Hmm. Right. Elizabeth. Looks easy enough. This is it, isn't it? Yep. Number nine. Done. Do it? You're a liar. But you can't blame me for looking Here's after my house. own interests, can you? Now I know Fitzroy has come calling. But I think you'll find your business with her has come to an end. <laughs> lions walk with lions, do it. Not hyenas. Now we need to find someone else to make those guns. No. Dead is dead, Elizabeth. Dead is dead. What? Where the hell did... I see heads. And I see tails. It's all a matter of perspective. Why are you following us? Who sent you? Comstock? What do you want? What do you see here? From this angle. Dead. Listen. And that angle? Alive. Walker. Chen Lin. This is becoming rather awkward. This one needs a bit of a nudge. We could spell it out for him, I suppose. The body's gone. It was never here. It's another Columbia. A different Columbia. The same coin. A different perspective. Heads. Tails. Dead. Alive. We have to go through. To this other Columbia, but how? It's like riding a bicycle. One never really forgets. One just needs the courage to climb aboard. If 
we go into this tear, I don't think I'll be able to bring us back. Are you sure you're ready? <laughs> Another world, Booker. Another Columbia. Something tells me one dead gunsmith ain't the only thing that's changed. <laughs> 